Okay, so the lighting is bad if for no other reason than it is well past two in the morning. I went for a had to go out for reasons that were deemed necessary, so I figured I'd take a look at what is happening now as of midnight yesterday, so literally the beginning hours of yes of not yesterday, because yesterday was Wednesday. The beginning minute of Tuesday. My pr provincial government, which is Ontario, Canada, declared that all non-essential businesses are to be shut down. Now, I was curious what is considered essential and not essential. I have to go out Friday, which is now tomorrow, because I keep thinking this is Wednesday. But I have to go out Friday, so I will see what is considered essential and non essential. But here's the thing RPM declared cannabis stores, the beer store, and the liquor store to be an essential business. So, first off, if cannabis were considered essential for medicinal reasons, you wouldn't need to purchase it at a cannibal store. You'd be able to get it via prescription at a pharmacy. So that's fucking bullshit. Frankly, I think it should be gotten by prescription at a pharmacy. And I don't even personally like cannabis. In fact, quite the opposite, quite the opposite. But anyways, let's not talk about the cannabis, because let's be honest. There are people who rely on it for medicinal purposes. Let's talk about the beer store and the liquor store. Why are these staying open? Well... First off, I didn't even realize they were open until I read an article when I came home. But they are considered essential because there are people with such a great dependency on alcohol that they can't physically function without it. They go into severe withdrawals and need to be hospitalized and we need to save the hospital beds for people with the coronavirus and not people suffering withdrawal symptoms for alcohol. Frankly, I smell bullshit. The government didn't care about these people before. Why do they care about them now? They don't. I think the real reason the beer and liquor store are remaining open because they're considered essential isn't so much the fact that it's essential that they stay open 
but that it's essential that they not shut down. Because if they were to shut down, these people they're claiming to stay open for, as well as a bunch of others, would rob them. Would rob them blind. And that is why I think they're considered essential to stay open. If the government gave a damn about these people, <coughs> well, first off, say, <laughs> pretty sure there's a medical history with these people. So, they will have them delivered enough alcohol for them to survive. Which may very well get rid of the people who depend on alcohol. Robbing the store. So that just leaves the people who aren't dependent on alcohol and they draw them blind. <sighs> In fact, I guarantee you. I know of a few people who, if I were to mention this to them, you would say, yeah, damn straight I'd rob the liquor store, damn straight I'd rob the beer store. <coughs> Fuck it all. Take my, take, take my truck. <coughs> <coughs> Have a baseball bat or a brick, breaks the door or the window, and just walk in and take what I can and leave. And that's why I think these, the beer and liquor store are considered essential business. Not because there are people who are dependent on alcohol. More that there are people who will gladly rob alcohol if the opportunity were to arise. But of course, is the government ever going to admit that? Nope. But I will bet everything I have, including my life, that that's the real reason they're staying open. Now, there is one thing I will be testing when I get my check-in.
And that is, are tobacconists considered essential? Because the same can be said true of nicotine. Now I just checked out the tobacconist website near me. And judging from what I am seeing, they're still open. Or at the very least they haven't mentioned a damp thing about them shutting down. And if I go whenever it is I get my check, probably tomorrow or Friday, first off I'm going to call the tobacconist to make sure I'm not wasting my time. But if they're still open, the reason I just mentioned, that's the real reason. Anyways, I'm about to eat and then try and head to bed because it is almost 2.20. Take care, everybody, and bye.